Hey, what's going on guys, Nick here, and for those of you that are obsessed with internet security or keeping anything online to you safe, look no further, because a new onion routing network called Hornet claims to keep your data under lock and key, all for speeds that are hundreds if not thousands of times faster than its current competitors. Let's get started. <laughs> So if you're paranoid like me when it comes to your internet security when dealing with spotty hotel Wi-Fi or bottleneck Starbucks connections, look no further because there are several preemptive measures you can take. You can use VPNs or virtual private networks that allow your computer to receive and share data over public networks as if it were connected to a virtual private internet, meaning that for those of you that need to access your company database or software outside of the office, a VPN may be the correct choice for you because it'll keep all your data safe under lock and key. A second way, designed as more of a broad strokes way of protecting yourself across all of the interwebs, is known as onion routing. In Onion networks like Tor, data starts from your computer wrapped in levels of encryption and passes through a voluntary network of thousands of intermediary computers, known as nodes. And when that packet of data travels from node to node, one layer of encryption is peeled back one at a time, much like an onion. The reason why it's so secure to direct much of your internet traffic through these networks is because each intermediary node neither knows the final destination or origin of your data, keeping you totally anonymous. Once the final node unpacks that last level of encryption, your data arrives at its destination, whether that manifests itself as sending an email or surfing the web. Tor is also the way to gain access to the deep web where much of the online illegal activities you hear about on the news happen. It's used daily by journalists, activists, and law enforcement groups. Now you may be asking yourself, if what I just told you sounds so enticing and defensive against online threats, why aren't onion networks the only way we access the internet? And the answer is simple, speed. Just imagine sending all of your internet data through these nodes. Obviously, it takes an incredible amount of time. Until now. It's time to introduce Hornet, a low latency onion routing network that claims to have node to node transfer speeds of 93 gigabytes a second. The researchers behind Hornet have published much of the math and algorithmic reasoning behind their product in an elaborate research paper, which you can read down below, and it seems to do a great job of highlighting the main differences between Hornet and its competitors. Other networks like Tor have to perform highly complex and time-consuming calculations when it comes to unpacking encryption from node to node. On the other hand, Hornet claims it can achieve record speeds because it carries all of the decryption keys necessary for your data in what's known as packet headers, which are stored on your home machine. This saves not only time, because now no node has to perform the same taxing calculation thousands of times, but also makes the network more secure as a whole, because now the only place where your decryption keys are stored are on your home machine and no node has access to them. It's a pretty ingenious concept. Like I said, guys, it's a brilliant technology highlighted in a very detailed research paper. Now it seems like the the only thing missing is large-scale network testing. The researchers only experimented with Hornet in their private five-man intranet, not with the millions of computers necessary to make this a viable and revolutionary market changer. That being said, I don't think we should dock them very many points for it because obviously Hornet was proposed as a strictly research-driven endeavor, and I'm sure further tests are being carried out, so let's give them a little space and see what happens. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.